April, I know you said that you wanted my vowels to be good and make you cry, but unfortunately I can't have you proofread this for me like you did for most of my college papers. But I will try my best. You know, I've had a hard time putting my feelings into words, especially when it comes to why I continue to choose and love you every day. You have been by my side for so long, I cannot imagine life without you. We have been together since junior year of high school, almost 10 years, and, that does not, and it does not seem like it's been that long. We have been by each other's side through all of the good and the bad. We have shaped each other into adults we are today, and I'm grateful I get to share the rest of my life with you. You are the person, <clears throat> you are my person that I could talk to about everything. You are able to tell what kind of mood I am just by looking at my face, and you are able to get me to express my feelings even when I don't want to. You continue to push me to do better every day. You help me become a better person. You have shown me what, it, what love feels like. We continue to build a stronger relationship. We balance each, one another and are able to put up with, with each other's attitudes. Today I vow I will continue to be a level-headed and keep you calm through the storms. I vow to be your be best friend and your husband. I vow to be there to catch you if you, if you should stumble and continue to fall more in love with you every day. I vow to treat you as an equal through the years of that life will give us and love you forever. John, <clears throat> 10 years later, here we're standing at our wedding. I waited so long to become your wife. Most people don't think they'll marry the person they started dating when they're 16, year old, 16 years old but high school sweethearts is exactly what we are. It feels like just yesterday, I was purposely leaving my highlighter in my locker just so I could have a reason to talk to you. That was my favorite part of the school day, when I would turn around to ask you to borrow your highlighter, even though most days you already have it in your hand, ready to hand it to me. I thought I should pay you back for always letting me use your highlighter. <laughs> um, I wanna start off by thanking you for the life that we share today. Throughout the last 10 years, we've grown together. I don't think I ever told you this, but you're the glue to our beautiful life together. This may be hard for most people to believe, but I'm not the most calm person. <laughs> you have a way of making me feel safe and secure with the things that we have created together. I cannot thank you enough for helping me become the person that I am today. You've stuck by my side through the best and worst and loved me for all that I am. You helped me to be the finest version of me that I can be. Thank you for always being the calm to my chaos. As your wife, I promise to continue to motivate and support you. I promise to stand by your side through the ups and downs. I promise to create a safe space for you when you need it. I promise to put us first and make sure that we are constantly working to grow together, not apart. I promise to tell you that I love you every day for the rest of my life. I promise to try to remember to fluff your pillows each night before bed. <laughs> and lastly, I promise always to leave all the bugs for you to kill. <laughs> John, this is not the beginning of our story yet a new chapter of our life together. I cannot be happier to tell everyone that I am your wife. Thank you for being the person I've always dreamed of and not being just my partner, but my biggest supporter and my best friend. I love you today, tomorrow, and to infinity and beyond. <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now share your first kiss as husband and wife. <laughs>